Hey, what's up, everybody? I just wanted to jump on and make a one-year review of a Ford hard-rolling tonneau cover. Uh, this is an OEM part that I had installed on my 2022 Power Boost a year ago. Um, and so I wanted to jump on and just kind of give you a quick review, show you around a little bit, and then kind of give you my thoughts on it. So um, I'll show you around real quick, and then we can talk a little bit about some of the features. To be completely honest, I've actually been really impressed with all of it. Sorry, the sun's a little bright, but uh, you can see it's vinyl on the top, black. I just have been cleaning it with a 303 surface protectant with uh, UV protection every few months and it's kept it looking honestly brand new. I haven't had really any issues with it. When the tailgate's up, it's completely locked. There's no way to get access to it. Tailgate has to be down so you can grab that. And it is hard on top. I think they say you can rest a couple hundred pounds on there. I actually have never put anything up on top just because I didn't want to scratch it or damage it at all. Um, but it's really easy to use. You just grab that lever there. I can do it with one hand here. Roll it up from this side. It's got some pads here. So that if that were to rest against your back window, it wouldn't do any damage there. It's got the Ford logo on there, which looks nice when it's rolling down the hill. This is just kind of like a felt material over the aluminum slaps so that if you're rolling it up, you're not touching an aluminum, uh, hot aluminum on a hot day after that's been sitting underneath there because that does heat up a little bit. But um, the felt makes that easier. Uh, I think that's one concern of people in the long term is that this felt might come loose and come off. Um, and that's kind of what some of the competitors have changed about theirs, but I have had no issues with it after a full year. And I drive around with this up quite a bit. It just has these straps and buckles here that you would just set in there like that. You can tighten that strap down. <clears throat> it's really, really easy to use. The nicest thing about these uh, hard rolling covers as I can still see out my back window when uh, when it's rolled up as compared to like the tri-fold tonneau covers that fold 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 and then block your entire back window These, this still gives me complete access to see the back of my bed I do have the bed camera and stuff on there and it, it all works really awesome and I've got like the dirt bites or anything back here I can still see exactly what's going on <clears throat> Uh, it has the strap on both sides, so you would just buckle that up there on this side as well. Um, I haven't had any issues with the buckles coming loose. Uh, it, it all seems really well built. Another concern is kind of this right here, which is kind of this rubber piece that is to seal it. I haven't had any issues with it coming up or loosening but I've kept this inside most of the time that I've had it. <clears throat> I don't leave it sitting out in the sun or put it really through any harsh conditions. I do take it through the car wash and there will be a little bit of water, especially up here in the front after I get out of the car wash. But uh, especially like going through like a quick quack or something that has brushes on it, it does just fine. So it's not completely waterproof. Like I said, it's just kind of this rubber seal that goes all the way up there. It's got these brackets mounted on the side. It's really easy to put together, just kind of secure those clamps there. They go all the way up and holds that in place. There's plenty of instructional videos of how to install them on your own. The biggest competitor with these is the Backflip brand, B-A-K Flip. This one would be if you're looking at that, their website, this one would be comparable to the Backflip X4 as far as the appearance and the functionality of it. Um, and then Backflip did do an X4S, which they replaced the felt with a rubber underneath there. Um, just kind of where that runs all the way up. <clears throat> and then they did their, their buckles a little bit different on the X4S. It's kind of like a little, you can look at their website, but it's kind of like a little hook and pull. And I think that probably would be better in the long term. As with anything that is vinyl material, it's gonna wear down with time. Like I said, this has been a year. I keep my pickup in the garage. Um, 
most of the time, uh, even at work, but it, uh, it have, I haven't had any really any issues with it. It still looks completely brand new. I've been very happy with it. The functionality of being able to f roll it up and still see out the back window is probably my favorite part. Um, it gives you a lot of security. I leave my fishing gear and stuff back here when I'm going inside or camping or leaving my pickup somewhere and I don't worry about it because you have to be able to unlock the door to unlock the tailgate to get into the back of the bed here through the tonneau cover. So overall, I've been really happy with it. I think it's a really good product. <clears throat> I just checked on the Ford's website. It sells for 1200 bucks which I think is about the same price as what the Backflip X4S is selling. Oh, the light's kind of weird there. <clears throat> uh, I think they're about 11, 1200 bucks. It's not a bad deal for securing your stuff. Um, I drive up to Idaho quite a bit to our cabin and even like heavy rain and snowstorms and stuff, our stuff in the back doesn't get wet. And only time I really see water pooling in there is when I go through the car wash and it's like forced water under pressure. So. Uh, honestly, really no complaints with it. I think long-term durability, you're maybe looking at eight to 10 years before it starts to break down if you take care of it. But like I said, just kind of do that 303 surface protecting on it every few months and it has been fine for me. Really no issues with it. Um, yeah, overall, I highly recommend it. I would do it again. Uh, if you're looking at a tonneau cover, I think these ones are, the hard rolling covers are the way to go. And um, really, I don't know too much of a difference between the Backflip X4 and this Ford one. I do know that the Backflip X4S, which my brother-in-law has, seems to be uh, designed. This It's kind of like the next step where they've looked at maybe some of the parts that have broken down over time and fixed those things. So... Um, yeah, so overall, super happy with it. Um, you guys know the drill with YouTube. If you like it, like, comment, subscribe. I'll be doing some more videos with the truck and uh, kind of going over some, some different things that I'm doing to it. So um, I'll catch you guys on the next one.